Hey, what's up, guys? Tenor Friday Dinner Steak here, and welcome back. Some more Hearthstone and Cup. We're gonna play some ranked play today, but uh, right now the heart. Well, actually, it's no, well, it's 3:47 p.m. So the Hearthstone, uh, well, the HCT um, Winter Europe uh, games are going on right now. The Winter Playoffs are going on right now, and a really fun deck. And it has nothing to do with Mechathun here, but a really fun deck I saw was, and you should go look up the gameplay is Viper's Peanut Shaman. And uh, the Twitch chat was calling it Frog Shaman, but it's just, it, it's a, it's a, it's, it's almost, it's a 17k dust deck. I mean, you got Electrical Storm Rage, Zentimo, um, Krogwa the Frog, Hagatha the Witch, Shutterwalk, Prince Kalisath, Zola, at least the Trailblazer, and Zillax. I mean, that's, that's an expensive deck. But he... <sighs> He, like, for the entire game, only had, like, 12 health because he was playing against, um, I forgot what his name was, but he was playing basically Hybrid Hunter against him, and he had him stuck at 11 health, but using Hagatha, and especially Shutterwalk, after playing, like, Kelaseth, um, uh, the, 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 it's just, you gotta go back and watch the gameplay footage. It's absolutely nutty, and we're gonna... We're going to go from there. I'm going to go transition to the Hearthstone game here. I just love watching playoff games so much. Here we got Mechathun, Cataclysm, Hooked, Reaver against a Priest. I'm going to... That might come back and bite me in the ass there a little bit, but, you know. Now we, we, drew, we drew Blood Bloom we have our curse into, into our strength. We drew, we drew blood bloom. So, I mean, there's something to say for that. <sighs> Quest, Quest Priest. Not, not worried at all about that. There's Cataclysm, and there's Mechathun. I'm glad when you put them in their deck, they show up in the top three of your cards. I'm glad I drew. I have my combo here, basically. I just need my two uh, Galvanizers, and we win. Simple as that. Gotta play something, right? Um, sucks that I'm not seeing any of the Twilight Drakes or the Mountain Giants in my starting hand. Or being drawn right away. But, you know. That's a that's a good that's a good counterplay there. Nine cards. If I do this, that takes me to eight. That upgrades that. But what what good is it to have an? I feel like that's that's a meaty enough of a card, right? Life tap there. Put it into there. So we're already losing on health. The quest for Priest doesn't bother me too much because this is an OTK deck. Um, sadly, we've gotten some really late game stuff going on here. Um, you know, hopefully, you know, he pushes me past that 15 health point so I can play Hooked Reaver with the next couple of turns here and really like, hey, like, kill this or you die kind of mentality. He's going to use Drain Soul on my own card trade that into that is he gonna give me the armor he will give me three armor actually we have ten cards in my hand probably time to play that can't can't hero power this turn sadly next turn we'll play this really sucks because you usually cheese those mountain giants out relatively early and those are gonna be so late in my deck Yuck. Some galvanizers would have been nice actually to pick up here. Uh, that's his turn in all of entirety. Yeah, I can't. Is it worth even playing Sun Fury Protector this turn? I feel like that's a huge waste, but might as well. 
He started first, so if he coins Psychic Scream, I'm not going to be too surprised. If he does, but... Eh. Gotta get some of these big boys out of my deck. Because he's still... The card game is... I'm only three cards ahead of him, so I gotta really be... There's his turn six play. Nine cards. Hook to Reaver. I'll push damage instead of fucking around with that Bone Drake. I don't really need to give that the time of the day to, uh... Let the Priest pop it on his own accord. You use this... Interesting play. He'll heal himself up. I have now 10 cards in my hand. Oh, this really sucks here because we gotta play something. Yikes, we gotta play something. Oh, shit. Did I just play both these boys? I didn't like doing that whatsoever. Those mountain giants are staying in the bottom of my deck, probably. We now have 14 damage on board. Hmm. Whew. What to do, what to do. Interesting play there. Using Shadow Word Death for that. I can't I can't put the Lich King in my I'm gonna We have a Galvanizer. Thank you. Might as well. It feels like a misplay. I feel like I'm playing sloppy today for some reason. But, I don't know. It's just... I don't know. That felt like a really sloppy play. Oh, yeah, that'll give him that'll give him a little bit of armor here. I forgot. This is Quest Priest. So, not like it's so good on the quest there. My card gain on you will be... I don't... You fucking whore. I'm gonna leave it like that. I feel like if I can life tap next turn, actually I can't. That was a waste because I would already have. God damn it! That that was a waste of a turn. That was that was a big waste of a turn. I should have just played that as such. He'll complete his quest. Sadly, um, bit of annoying. I mean, I don't really care that he completed his quest, but it's just a little bit smidgen. Wait, play this. Then play that. Boom. Now we have eight cards in our hand. We can spell stone whenever he throws down. And then we just keep tapping and tapping and tapping and tapping and tapping and tapping and tapping. And tapping. We got to make sure we have at least four health before we do the combo because that can happen. 
and we'll just kind of let this priest figure out what to do. Actually, it's turn 10 next turn. A Siphon Soul and a Fully Charged Amethyst Spellstone doesn't seem like a bad idea. That's going to generate us 10 health and pull us up to the 24 mark. Let's see what he pulls out of here. Actually, Hooked Reaver is going to come back and bite me in the ass. What was that card? Yeah. Actually, he's copied quite a few cards from my hand. So you can have anything really here. Too bad he has none of the combos. That'd be very funny if he could steal an OTK from me. In such a way like that. So I'd fill himself back up. Nice amount of health. And I'll just make all that health basically seem non-existent within the next couple of turns here. 18 damage next turn on board. If he doesn't do anything about it. Hmm. hmm. Pulling him at Jungle Hunter would be nice right about now. Will you Spirit Lash? Keep trying to heal himself up there. Follow with a Primordial Drake. And that's his turn. There. Eight cards. That's Defile. Nine cards. Do I really dare play the Lich King? Do I dare play the Lich King? To that... I don't he might have some defiles in his deck. I will play that. That is that's my play for that turn here. Another primordial drake. Not good for me. Luckily I have a siphon soul to back my ass up here. And a Drake, too. Let's play... No, that's 10, Jordan. Do math. Okay, five cards remaining. Great, you get five, like, extra cards out of that. Enjoy them. For what it's worth. Ten cards, hand is full. Turn our chain gang. Take the armor right now. It's essentially game over for him at this point. Yeah, because right now I'm just looking to cycle through my... Well, it was game over at him. For him. But this is bringing some un... Um... I don't have anything in two spots to actually trigger the. I have 10 cards. Go here. Right. Set up. Yeah, nine cards. Nine cards in your hand. Okay. Well played indeed. And that's how you start the day off, ladies and gentlemen, with a nice OTK.
Should put me into rank 14 actually right now. It will take me into rank 14. Let's play some Recruit Hunter, right? Because I think some of my quests today. Resolve around winning as Hunter. Yep. Yeah, get some Hunter gameplay in there. Dude, Mechathune, Warlock. That's a fun class. Or fun, fun deck, my bad. It's <sighs> a lot of fun. Can we get to play some Hunter? Odd Mage or Control Mage? Control Mage is actually, um... It's actually meta viable viable I'm gonna keep that I'm gonna keep that because I'm going second and I'm gonna keep that because that's like a wreck star defender of Argus devil sword egg and play dead with coin that's potent that's gross and that's very potent let us see what our opponent brings to the dinner table nothing too much from that from the spider bomb turn two keliseth is good if i get candle shot i'll even pick that up here it's not odd mage aggro mage question mark Ooh, that's super good that's super good we'll see what he's gonna play if he plays explosive trap or exp no he's actually gonna or explosive rune my bad uh, no, he's actually going to set it up like this. So I'll leave it open like that for him. Discover a secret. Could be anything... Vaporize, Counterspell. From him doing this, it seems like he didn't get what he wanted because he's taking so long here. I'm trying to think what I want to do here next turn. Because I could... I could play Terra Scale Stalker. And if he gets dicked by explosive rune, so be it. Um, no, he's going to push face here instead. Which makes me want to believe. And in believing, I will here, actually. He's actually good play. Good play. I respect a respectable play. Really cleared the good chunk of my tempo off the board. It doesn't seem to be anything of value. I bet it is a counter spell. I feel like it really I feel like it really is a counter spell. So I wanna get this carnivorous actually ooh, do I wanna cube it? I wanna see I wanna see a play dead in my hand. Ooh. Dragon's Fury, I think the card's gone. No, he's gonna polymorph my fucking egg. God damn it. That is the... Why? Don't need him picking up armor. I'm going to make the off chance suggestion that that is going to be tr uh, counter spell. And props like uh, Blizzard. Yeah. Not too surprised. Uh, 
How do I want to do this here? Probably Deathstalker Rexar. Counter spell check. Yes, all right. Got that out of the way. My, I, I was thinking put you yeah, put your card in a carnivorous cube, protect it. But I don't know if he has another polymorph. I really don't know if he has another polymorph. He's gonna actually play that and take a huge chunk of my board out of play. <sighs> Probably a Witchwood Grizzly. King Crush, actually, to the party. Uh, he'll probably focus on the King Crush quite a bit here. So I'll Carnivorous Cube my Katharina. And then that's pretty much GG at this point. No, he's gonna freaking do that. That's not enough to win the game. You What? You messed up. Actually, no. I'll actually get some health back from that. Good for him. Uh-oh, Rex, are you almost glitched out on me there a little bit, buddy? Let's 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 do this first. Now this man just kind of thinking. What the hell am I gonna do? It's quite a bit he could do. If he plays a couple more cards, my MC tech might actually become viable. But this, this seems like a fucking monstrosity of a card that I made. Not too pretty, not too good. Yeah. Yeah, he's gonna get life steal off of all of this too. So I've that that stinks. Polymorph, not too surprised actually. But that means he doesn't have any more of those in his deck. It's a real problem right there. I gotta find four damage from somewhere. Hmm. Where do I find four damage? guess two I guess this way huh No poisonous charge, though, to really get me a little bit of an edge. This guy's stuck at two health. He's going to get, like, six health back this turn. I think he's really winning his options. There's no, like, face damage in this deck from spells. So you can't really cheese it out. He will use Flame Strike and wipe the board up here a little bit. He'll go there. Oh, and he's going to cheat me out of... Okay. This is bad. This is very bad. Might actually lose this here because that fucking... Lame-ass mechanic. trying to think here because he's really he knows what else he's got here he's got a deal he's got no more polymorphs he's got raven familiar gonna pull that would not recommend him actually playing that this turn because that could really come back and bite him in the ass if he does play that i think he loses and i hope he realizes that too 
But like, if he plays that card, it's gonna. You've got to be kidding me here. Oh, I'm retarded. Actually, yeah, I am retarded. I should have traded into the 3-3. God freaking damn it. I mean, I know he can clear this board. Yeah, I know he can clear this board up. Yeah. Yep. Wow, such innovative, innovative gameplay. Wow. All right, give me another charge minion, please. Four. I have to wait till next turn, actually. So what we got? So this gives plus two two. So this is five. Nine. That's not enough.
We'll call that a game, ladies and gentlemen. We never find any mistake here. Got shit on side. some elemental mage. You know, Frostless Janna. You know how she's fair and balanced. As always, guys, I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.